31 back. In this video tutorial, I'll be showing you how to download Sentinel 5P data, air quality data. Open your browser and type in Copernicus data space ecosystem, hit the button search. I'll be giving this link in the description, please do check it out. So Copernicus data space ecosystem, click on this link. Yeah. So if you are interested, you can also share your feedback if you are already registered and using it. So now select the explore data and uh, select a Copernicus browser. And uh, in order to download any image, uh, we require a login. So hit the button login. If you don't have an account, it's very easy. Within uh, 60 seconds, you can create an account. It just requires your uh, email ID and your name details. That's it. So let me put the email and password and login. If you don't have an account, click here register. You can easily create an account. Now after uh, logging in, we are going to choose a specific area. So first uh, let me search the area of interest. Now hit the button search. Okay, so by uh, right clicking, you can find the results. For example, uh, New Delhi, India. So I'm going to select uh, New Delhi, India. So basically you'll be getting multiple results. So you can choose ac accordingly. So now you can see that this is the Delhi region. Let me change the base map. So uh, let me choose uh, the lighter version. So you can see here this is Delhi and for selecting uh, the area of interest you can use this option and select this uh, draw rectangular area of interest. Now click anywhere in this place and uh, just uh, drag the box like this and when you are finished use the mouse and click finish you can also change the box size on the corner you can just have to long press and you can draw the box accordingly so now after selecting the area of interest you can see the option search over here hit the button search and select the sentinel 5p which is providing a lot of uh, air quality data sets. For example, you can see uh, CH4, CO, CHCO, NO2, O3, SO2, likewise. So in this uh, example, we are going to see NO2. So the download procedure is same for uh, all the data. So choose uh, NO2 and come down, specify the time range. So I am going to specify the time range from January 1st, 2024 and up to 19th of this month. You can also choose the hours. You can use the filter by month also. For example, you are searching for uh, an entire year. You can customize for uh, which month you want and which month you don't. For example, if you don't want January, you can click on January. Uh, that is you can unselect January February like this so now hit the button search so within a few seconds you can see a lot of uh, search results has been come up so we got the search results you can see quite a lot of images available so just zoom back you can see the You can see this image is covering the complete area of the study. You can check with the previous image. You just have to keep the cursor on the top. Let me show you that. So, so you can see this completely covering this region. So you can choose the image accordingly, whether it is co covering your entire study area. 
okay so now uh, let me uh, you can see you can find the uh, information about this product so i'm going to choose this image so it is around uh, coming around 61 uh, mb let me choose the i button click on the i button so you get the product information over here when it, the image has been acquired you can see the footprint over here you can also find the instrument details then product you can see the informations product type is no2 so the download procedure is same for uh, any products it can be so2 no2 or o3 the procedure is same so now you can download this image and uh, if you want to visualize this image click on the option visualize you can have the view of this image how it looks like let us wait for a few seconds it will be getting loaded yeah now you can see this is how the image looks like so this is the visualization of this image and this is nitrogen dioxide NO2 you can also find the legend the concentration from low it is going to high so now going back to the search yeah so let me download this image like click by clicking here the download will be started you can see it will be highlighted over here once it has been completed automatically the image will be downloaded let us wait for it so the image is going to be downloaded as you can see here now it is asking me where to save this image so I'm going to hit the button save so successfully we have downloaded the image as you can see here let me show it to you in the folder so this is how the image looks like let us extract the image and it is in a nc file format as you can see over here so let us go back to the uh, browser and if you want to have the, for example we have just visualized this image let me select visualize and you can see if you want to download this image you can use this option for downloading this image hit the button download so if you want it in a basic uh, view you can download it in a basic view you can use this option basic just for uh, downloading and visualizing the image you can uh, see uh, if you want to have the caption you can have the caption which it will be having data source date zoom scale branding and uh, if you want to show the scale so sorry show the legend uh, you can enable it and uh, crop to area of interest so if you don't want it to crop it to the area of interest you can just deselect it and you can see that you can preview the entire image instead if you want you can also uh, draw the AOA so we have drawn the AOA that will be shown draw an AOA on the image you can add some description if you can download in 254 format JPEG and PNG so let me download this one So let me save this and let us have a look at this image. So this is just for the visualization purpose. So you can see it is a Sentinel 5P NO2. The date time has been given. You can see the legend and the AOA is also been marked over here. So likewise, if you want for uh, for presentation, you can directly download this image so let us close this image and go back to the browser if you wanted to put it in a js platform you can choose analytics and uh, here you can choose the uh, format for example jpeg uh, georeference no georeference it is available uh, if you want a georeference select tiff 16 bit 32 bit so i'm going to use uh, 16 bit image resolution you can choose i'm going to choose high you can choose a projection so i'm going to uh, leave it to the basic version so you can see here clip extra band so why you have to clip that because this if it is a no normal image viewer 
it can't show more than three bands so you have to use QJS platform to to see the image which is having more than three bands so if you want to keep uh, view it in the normal you can uh, use this uh, clip extra band otherwise you can leave it so let us download this image and view it in the JS let us save it yeah we have saved it let us view it in so this is the image which we have downloaded tiff let me add it to the ArcGIS so you can just check how it is so it is the cropped version so it has been downloaded in the cropped version if you are having any other doubts please do ask in the comment section the procedure is same for downloading uh, NO2 or uh, SO2 or uh, CO any air quality data from Sentinel-5P can be downloaded like this thanks for watching goodbye